got shit to say. Hey, way back. Uh, I got some shit to say. Now, I'm not in a complete process right now. I'm in the midst of getting all. I'm going to all this off. Okay? I'm going to cut all of it off. Niggas is like, somebody go check on sis. Something wrong with her. What's wrong with her mentally? She done lost it. Why when a woman decides, hey, I'm going to cut this hair off because I want to see my scalp. She got to have a mental problem. Nothing is wrong with my brain, you guys. I'm not suffering from no emotional shit. Nothing. I literally been talking about this for years. How I want to see my scalp. I know every single part of my body. I know where every single mole is. Anybody that's ever done my hair has heard me say it. What up, Oscar? Hey, boo. Anybody that knows me knows me, knows I've been talking about this for a long time, okay? Now, uh, Precious went to go get some clippers so she can even it out. But um, And then when I get back to L.A., I'm getting it all cut because I want to see my moles, okay? I have, I've been counting, I have almost 100 moles all over my body. But how many do I got in my scalp? I found one over here. I found one over here. I never seen it before. Right here behind my ears, one right there. I found it. And y'all gonna see it all. When when we cut all my hair off, I'ma still be fine as fuck. Niggas is still gonna try to fuck. Guys, don't worry. There'll be plenty of dick for me. And it will grow back. And I gotta just tell y'all, after I had cut it off, because it was so dusty, because I had those braids in for two months, right? And so I cut the cut everything off and it was dusty and I jumped in the shower and it's the first time I've ever taken a shower and was not concerned about getting my hair wet. And that shit felt good to the motherfucker. <laughs> that shit felt so good. It felt so good to just be like, yeah, I can get my hair wet. I'm not, I don't have to worry about it being nappy or, you know, whatever. It's, it is. It's, it's just, it is what it is. This is how I got, when I was born, I might have had more hair than this, actually. <laughs> I had hair all the way to my forehead. My head has always been covered. So I'm not tripping. I'm like, you can see my face even better. Like, my neck don't hurt. You know how heavy them locks was? That's a lot of neck work. That's a lot of neck work. Okay. Now we just, boom, shoulders is relaxed. My gait, my gait is better. Like, <laughs> And now I can go running every day. I can train my ass off every single day and not have to worry about, oh, my hair. Do, it, the hair let, and let's just be honest. Your hair takes, as a black woman, I don't know about white women, but as a black woman, that's a good hour to two, three hours of your fucking day. Even if your hair is braided, you got to grease your scalp. You got to tie them up at night. You got to like, you got to make sure they look neat. It is a lot of work. So I'm taking time off. I'm going to use that same energy that I would have been putting into my hair, into my mind. Well, my mind has got a lot of information in it already. Let's just be honest. I'm actually quite knowledgeable. But it's just going to give me more time to work on my body, get my get get everything together. Like y'all going to be like, damn, Tiffany lost her mind. She cut her hair. But then you're going to be like that body, though. Oh, and that mall right there. Oh, and that, she actually got a really cute little head. Like, and then I could get that. Oh, you know what? I always want to use one of them sponges. You ever see them niggas? They be using the sponges and they be doing a sponge like this on the head. And they had like the cute curls. I'm going to be able to do that. Also, I'm going to be able to have waves. I did. I was watching some YouTube videos. I'm going to have some bomb ass waves. You're going to be seeing me. You're going to be thinking I'm saying bye. Because, bitch, I'm going to be wavy. <laughs> it's going to be cute. I'm about to be killing them. And I'm going to do it all natural. Now, I might get a little brown in it, a little brown. And that's, I'm going to spray some sun in in that bit. I'm going to put some sun. Or I might even keep it super duper natural and just put lemon juice in my hair and then go stand in the sun. Let God take care of this. Oh, and it's going to grow back so thick and pretty. I'm going to be so cute. Y'all don't even understand how, like, I feel really good about it. My sister said that I'm going to cry tomorrow. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be mad about it tomorrow. But I, I really don't think I am going to be mad at all. I feel really, really good. And even though it's uneven right now, Precious will be here with some clippers soon, and we're going to even it out. And then next week, I'm going to go to go to the barber. You know, I had a barber come to me, and we're just going to go baldy bald. And if they don't show up like they said they would, I'll shave this shit myself. <laughs> 
<laughs> but I'm pretty sure they show up because they were they want my money. So, yeah. Any questions? Yeah, I I, I feel free. Yes, I do feel free. Shea Moisture. Mm hmm. Shea Moisture. Also, you know, I got some, olive, I got aloe vera plant and I got this little mix that I've made myself with my aloe. So I'm going to see what that do. I'm going to see what that do. Mm hmm. This all natural right now. No makeup. No, no eyebrow plucks. Nothing like that. No, nothing. Mustache. Nothing. Still there. Uh huh. Everything. Boom. How God made me. I actually should find, I think I, I was looking at one of my baby pictures. It's my hair is bigger, but this is saying like uneven kind of nap going on. But it's pretty, it's soft too. It's soft. It's still grabbable, but we're going to take all that off. It's going to be ungrabbable. And then look at my gray, my patch of gray. I've had this gray since I was 13. I was thinking, man, it might be funny if I just leave, cut everything off, but just leave the gray so motherfuckers know I'm wise. <laughs> but, then, but then I would think something was wrong with me. I would think I would have a mental problem if I did that. So we're just going to cut it all off. But I feel really good about it. And um, I appreciate everyone who tuned in to hear me chime in for the people that's trying to say I done lost my damn mind. Because I have not. If anything, I've gained so much mind, so much peace, and I still look better than you, bitch. Whoever, and that's for whoever said I lost my mind. <laughs> they might look better than me, but I doubt it. <laughs> Bye, y'all.